Hi and welcome to another episode of Mike's Garage. So I have another great one for you today. So today I'm gonna to talk about the oil level on your Mustang or any other engine as far as where it should be on the dipstick, um, the different advantages to having it at the top compared to the bottom. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look. All right, so here's a good old Mach 1 here. So let's take a look at the dipstick. Let's see where I have it at for level. As you can see, I have it at the very top line of normal. Now there's advantages and disadvantages. When you have it at the top line, if you're doing hard acceleration, hard cornering, the chance of you running the uh, pickup dry is slim to none. So that's the advantage of it. The disadvantage is the crankshaft is going to fling more of the oil with rotation, which throws off the balance uh, a little bit of the crank. Uh, so that, that definitely is the disadvantage. The other thing too is it can foam the oil and that's more going to happen if you're above that normal, say uh, you're at that top line and you added an extra half quarter quarter in there. Um, and with doing that, you could actually lower the oil pressure, believe it or not. So uh, too much of a good thing is sometimes bad. Now, one trick that racers used to do back in the day is they would take the... Uh, the oil and they would have it a little bit on the low side. They'd be at that bottom line or just a little bit above it. The reason for that is you can pick up a little bit of horsepower because it's not being chewed up by the crank flinging around that extra oil. So that's the pros and cons to having too much oil and too little. You could have it just in the middle. I just like it at the very, very top just because of the hard acceleration from this supercharger and it just gives me a little bit of peace of mind. So once again, if you like my videos, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And thank you, thank you, thank you for watching Mike's Garage.